So far, that's happened four times in six innings as the Sooners are cruising here, 7 nothing as we head to the seventh. Runners are back in action right here at Hart Field. They take on UC Santa Barbara Tuesday, the 22nd. Game time at 6 p.m. Look, the Roadrunners are making a defensive change here. Grote John, who just fouled out, has uh, been replaced by Joey Sanchez. Sanchez is off to a little bit of a slow start offensively this season. He was the starting third baseman last year when the Roadrunners made their late season push and uh, winning the WAC tournament and getting into the NCAA tournament. He was a very key member of that team on offense and defense. Started the year as a starting third baseman, but uh, now coming off the bench. And top of the seventh here, seven nothing Oklahoma. Number 22, Sheldon Noisy. Sheldon Noisy, the number three batter for the Sooners, is leading off against Cody White, who's in the, out there for his second inning of work. White had a very good inning in the sixth, striking out two of the three batters. Soft line drive that was backhanded by third baseman Grochon was the only other out he recorded in the inning. Now Noisy, the three, four, five hitters coming up. Here's the first pitch, low and away for a ball, one and oh. Jack, Jack Flansburg, the second baseman, is on deck, followed by Alex Wise, the right fielder. A little hesitation here is the Bakersfield catcher. Kyle Adkins goes out to uh, talk to Cody White. 1-0 count here on Noisy. Very deliberate here. Now White's into his motion. Here's the pitch. Swung on and missed. Fastball challenged him. Big swing by Noisy. Didn't get it. Ball was clocked at 92. That's pointed out by John Farron. Good eyes. Probably the best fastball anybody's thrown all weekend here for the Roadrunners. Here's the 1-1 one -one delivery. Another fastball, and this time Noisy lines it in the left field for a base hit. Lead-off single here for Noisy. The last second base. Last pitch was uh, thrown by him, and then they threw the same pitch, and this time Noisy didn't overpower it, but uh, solid line drive. One hop to the left fielder, Deaton. That's Noisy's third straight hit in this game. He had a triple in the third and single RBI single in the fourth and, an R and a single leading off here in the seventh. He had three hits in the first game. That's a six-hit day for him. Jack Flansburg fouls off the first pitch he sees. Cody White. I wouldn't think that the uh, Sooners would be doing any running at this point. They comfortably ahead 7 nothing. You don't usually want to pour it on. Kind of rub it in your other team's defense in the face, so you're probably going to see him play pretty standard stuff here. Next pitch is in the dirt. That doesn't mean they won't take an extra base if the ball gets away from a catcher or there's a defensive mistake, but... Uh, Stealing and that kind of thing you don't usually see uh, once the game gets a little bit out of hand. One and one count here with Flansburg the batting. Cody White pitching, here's the delivery. High with a fastball. That's at 89. Two and one. Seven nothing here, Oklahoma leading the Roadrunners. Two one pitch. On its way, a little bit low. Three balls and one strike. White has had some issues with walks, as we mentioned earlier. Had a very good sixth inning. And again, don't want to put people on here. Of course, you don't want to give up anything big either. 3-1 count. Now he steps off the rubber. Back on now, looking in for the sign. Looks over at first. The 3 1 pitch on its way. Check swing. Call the strike anyway. Full count. 88 mile an hour fastball that time. Flansburg. He had a double and scored a run earlier in the game. Also popped out and grounded out. 
3-2 pitch on its way by Cody White. Low, ball four, very close pitch. So White issues a walk. The first two right runners, number batters seven. for the Sooners Alex reach here in the Wise. seventh. That's first and second, nobody down with Alex Wise now batting for the Sooners. Wise is one for three with a bunt single in the second inning and then flied out and popped out. This bunt single is an attempted sacrifice that the starting pitcher A.J. Monterey has bobbled and threw past first base that allowed two runs to score that kind of started this whole game going in Oklahoma's way. White bluffs to throw to second, but nobody's covering and Noisy's only a step off the base anyway. White into a stretch, looks at second. Comes, then we again bluffs. Again, nobody covering. Now Kyle Adkins goes out. Want to make sure they're on the same page. Sooner is in control here. Seven nothing as we're in the seventh inning. Roadrunners have had only two singles thus far, only two base runners. As freshman Chris Andritzos has been very sharp for the Oklahoma Sooners. Looking to lower his earn run average, which he's already done. First pitch on the way and swung on and fouled away to the right. Wise doubled and scored in the fifth inning, walked and scored in the second inning. In between, he flied out to right. White, very deliberate working. Here comes the throw. Ball bounces. Atkins can not only knock it down and base runners move up on the wild pitch. So that is the third or fourth wild pitch, I believe, uh, in this game. They've all contributed to the scoring for the Sooners. Second and third now with nobody down. Infield back for Bakersfield. They're, there's a ground ball to third, booted by Joey Sanchez. Coming in to score is Noisy. Remaining at second is Flansburg. The ball was in front of him. That will be an error on Joey Sanchez. And that increases the lead to eight to nothing for Oklahoma. Now Hollis, the went in defensively in the last half inning, is now batting for the first time. Ben Hollis, he started uh, earlier in the series. He's a junior outfielder out of Longview, Texas. One and no count on Hollis. Left-handed hitter against the right-handed pitcher White. Swung on and line fouled on the left field line. Out on the no man's land there behind the Sooners bullpen. Young man with bright green pants is running down there to go get that souvenir. There's a young lady running after her too. Who's gonna get it first? It's the best foot race we're gonna see all game. And it looks like the little boy might've got, well, I'm not sure who got it. Meanwhile, on the plate here, Hollis fouls it away, and the girl got it. Young man didn't run real hard after her, and she saw that, and she beat him to the ball. She's going to get that ice cream. Anyway, in the meantime, it's one ball and two strikes here on Ben Hollis. Actually, maybe not. She just throws the ball back. Probably the daughter of somebody who works here, and they, didn't, they probably don't get the souvenir. One and two the count here on Hollis. Here's the pitch. A little bit high with a fastball, 89 miles an hour. It evens the count at two and two. Oklahoma leading Bakersfield eight nothing here in the seventh. Cody White into his motion. Here's the pitch, swung on and grounded foul up the first baseline. Count remains two and two.
Hollis. Waiting for the next pitch. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center field. Who wants it? And looks like the center fielders, Seelman gave up on the ball, thinking Deaton was going to catch it, and the ball lands between them. It's a go for a pop fly single. The ball should have probably been caught. A little miscommunication out there. Number 44, Austin O'Brien. Runner at second, Flansburg, was not going anywhere, so he only advances 90 feet. Alex Wise goes into second, so the bases are loaded now with no outs, and Roadrunners, frankly, have not played a very good game here today. They've, uh, you know, some misplays on defense. That was another one. Um, and, you know, again, when, you've, when things are not going well, these types of things happen. They've lost 12 of their last 13 games. First pitch now to... Austin O'Brien is fouled off to the right. O'Brien has a home run and a sacrifice fly, one for two officially in this game. Cody White kind of a little bit victimized here. There's been an error already this inning and a fly ball that should have been caught that landed between two outfielders. Austin O'Brien takes high with a fastball, but the ball is counted even at one and one. Sooners already leading 8 nothing and looking to pile on more here. High with a fastball at 89 miles an hour. It looks like White's trying to overthrow a little bit. Just got to kind of compose yourself. And even though the defense has had a couple of miscues this inning, you just got to let the defense make the plays behind you and just do what you got to do. Frustrating time right now for the Roadrunners. Here's the 2-0 pitch, not close, ball three. Three and one count, excuse me. Three and one, bases loaded, nobody out here. Already a run in for the Sooners. They're out hitting Bakersfield 11 to two. The runners have committed three errors in this game. Only two base runners for Bakersfield through six. Three and one count here. White steps off the rubber and O'Brien steps out of the batter's box. Austin O'Brien. Kid out of Osa Owasso, Oklahoma. Here's the 3-1 pitch. Swung on, line drive, base hit up the middle in the center field. Coming in to score is Flansburg. Here comes the throw of the plate. Not in time. As Hollis, I'm sorry, Alex Wise beats the throw in a very close play. A nice throw there by center fielder Seelman. Two run single by O'Brien, that gives him four RBIs in this game. Cody Thomas. And that increases the lead to 10 to nothing. And here comes Bob Macaluso out to, in all likelihood, make a pitching change. The, and he does get the ball as we have a new pitcher coming in. Cody White, a little bit snake bit in that inning, an error and a Misplay by the outfield didn't help him. But it's been that kind of day for Bakersfield. Let's see who's in here to pitch here. So Bakersfield's pitcher is Isaiah Moten. He pitched earlier in this series. Isaiah Moten. Moten, a right-hander, stocky. Six foot one, 220 pound freshman out of Temecula. Drew Seelman, the center fielder, also out of Temecula. They both uh, out of Temecula Valley High School, teammates in high school, I'm sure. Moten. Thus far this year, he's got a 7.11 earn run average. This is his sixth appearance, pitching seven Six and a third innings. Has a lot of five hits and five walks. Six runs, five earned, and six and one third innings. So the run runners getting a real uh, look at a lot of relievers here this week in the Sooner series. And frankly, I don't think there's been a whole lot of uh, anything settled on who's going uh, to be pitching in certain situations. We've had a few 
highlights, but uh, it's been a uh, rough outing here for the runners, especially in this game. 10 runs on 12 hits for Oklahoma. No runs, two hits, and three errors for Bakersfield. Cody White allowed three runs. Two of them earned thus far, but he's responsible for the runner on second and the runner on first. One inning plus, didn't get an out here in the seventh inning, although again, there was he should have had two outs, three hits, a walk, two strikeouts. And that's where we are now, so. Cody Thomas, the designated hitter, now batting with runners on first and second and nobody out. Three runs in here for Oklahoma in the seventh. First delivery is swung on and fouled back, 0-1-1. The fans here that are rooting for Bakersfield are shouting encouragement out to the runners. Fairly quiet crowd here today. Smaller crowd here today than there was the last couple of nights, I think. Well, the people have been coming and going today. Swung on, there's a line shot in the right field. Robo is the right fielder, races far to his left. He bobbles it once. Meanwhile, coming in to score is Ben Hollis to make it 11 to nothing. O'Brien rushes over to third on the double by Catcher, number 41, Rene Martinez. Cody Thomas. Eleven nothing now in favor of Oklahoma. That's their thirteenth hit. Renee Martinez, the ninth batter in the order, is coming to the plate. The seventh hitter this inning. Runs on second and third with one down. Here's the pitch. And the dirt bounces. Adkins knocks it down, keeps it in front of him. No advance by the runners. Four runs in this inning in the seventh to uh, really kind of break it open. It was already seven nothing before, now 11 nothing in favor of Oklahoma. They're closing in on a four game series sweep and a doubleheader sweep today over Bakersfield. Moten stretches, looks over at third, here's the pitch. Fastball down the middle for a strike, one and one. Got another pitcher up in the Bakersfield bullpen Pitchers are also up in the Oklahoma bullpen. Gritzos has been very sharp at this point. They may want to just go ahead and call the day with the Sooners already leading 11 to nothing. Moten, one and one count. Here's the pitch. Swung on and grounded to third. Sanchez has it. Throws over to first in time. Throw back over to third. Thrown away by Max Carter. Coming in to score is Cody Thomas. So the errors just keep coming here for the runners. Martinez out on a 5-3 put out, gets an RBI because uh, O'Brien scoring on the play. And then on uh, Cody Thomas, third who was at second base, broke for third the moment Sanchez let go of the ball. And then Max Carter threw wildly going back over to third base, trying to retire Thomas. And uh, Thomas then comes in to score on the E3. Now the pitch is lifted down the right field line and out of play. Thomas Hughes, the batter, the struck out his first appearance in the sixth inning as a, after coming in to replace Cade Harris at third base. It's now 13 to nothing in favor of Oklahoma. Six runs here in the seventh inning. 13 runs on 13 hits, no errors for Oklahoma. Zero runs, two hits, four errors for Bakersfield. Next pitch, low and away for a ball. One and one. Strike two called on the next pitch. One ball and two strikes. Moten. Next delivery, swung on and grounded to first. Two hopper, Max Carter has it, tags the base. Out number two. The fielder, 
Number four, Hunter Haley. Hunter Haley, the ninth batter of the inning to bat. With two outs, nobody on. Six runs in here in the seventh. Oklahoma has opened up a 13-0 lead over Bakersfield. Hunter Haley today has a single, an RBI single, another single, and has popped out and lined out. Two for four in this game. In the first game of the doubleheader, he was two for four with a pair of RBI singles plus a walk. Next pitch is outside for a ball, 2-0. Oh. Two and oh count here on Hunter Haley as we're in the seventh inning. Pitch is down and in, 3-0. and oh. Three-zero pitch, strike on the inside corner. Three and one. Oh, and here's the three-one delivery. Outside ball four. Short so number twenty-two, Sheldon Noisy. Sheldon Noisy, who started this six-run inning with a single to left against Cody White, seemed like an hour ago. His second appearance, now a pinch runner going in for the Sooners at first base. That'll be Reggie Wright, a junior outfielder out of Chokata, Oklahoma, and Eastern Oklahoma State. Takes over at first base. Noisy has had six hits today, three hits in this game, three hits in the opener. First pitch outside corner at the knees for a strike, 1-0. Noisy came into this game batting 343, so he's probably up in the 360s by now, if not higher. 0-1 oh, count to him. Here's a delivery. Swung on and lifted down the right field line foul over the Bakersfield bullpen and rolling out toward the parking lot. 0-2 oh the count on Noisy. He struck out in the first inning and then hasn't been retired. Triple, single, single. <laughs> Noisy patiently waiting at the plate, moting into his warning, into his stretch. Comes to the plate. Strike three call on the outside corner at the knees. Noisy doesn't like the call, but it looked like a pretty good pitch from here. So the Sooners.